Monday. It's freezing. Um, for work today, oh my god, it's really loud. Hold on. So for work today, I'm going to one of our clients, it's a mustard boutique, and we're doing this like monogram jar outreach to a bunch of our media contacts and we're hand delivering them. So I'm going to be running around to like news studios like CBS and like ABC and um, like different opinion, opinion leaders like Zega and they like do the restaurant readings and things like that. Just a bunch of those kind of media people so running around doing that hand delivering them and it's freezing outside but um, I'm uptown right now near the boutique at Lincoln Center and um, I'm outside of ABC Studios but only because it's right near the boutique so this will probably be one of the first places I'm delivering but like they film right in there anyway it's really cute up here because they are a little more festive all the trees have lights on them and yeah so hopefully it'll freeze today but we're gonna try and do it as fast as possible to get back to the office um and i'm not really sure how i'm gonna carry all these jars of mustard around either but um i'm feeling pretty festive because hey look so we have these like pretty lit up trees and then across the street they're selling christmas trees and yeah it's just really starting to feel like this season and i'm running around like delivering gifts so season of giving this is one of our clients it's my um like the mustard and i don't think the boutique is open yet they open at 10 it's like quarter of they have all these fancy mustards and then we're gonna take one of these jars that's gonna be monogrammed for each person that we're outreaching to so yeah, we'll see how that goes. I think I'm gonna go next door to this coffee place and get a coffee because coffee. So. I think I've said this before, but I only put milk in my coffee. I never sweeten it. I don't know why, but love that milk. Oh, it's a dreary day. I'm going to be making these deliveries with my coworker Colleen. She's getting coffee right now. I love her. She doesn't move back to France because like, she's supposed to only be here for a year, but she wants to stay. So she's going to try and figure that out, I think. So hopefully she stays. We're going to do it in a fast So you're not excited? <laughs> We just filled all these jars with mustard. Okay. You can sure. see how they're monogrammed. So, yeah. gonna deliver these babies. What am I going to, what am I going to so I just made my first delivery at Rockefeller Plaza. It was for two people at New York Live. And I had to go to like four different offices because I wasn't registered to drop it off. But anyway. First destination checked off the list, but I thought I would take a second to show you guys the tree now that it's all decorated. The last time you saw it, it was covered in scaffolding. And this is what it looks like. It looks really nice. And it's like obviously not as bright as it would be at night, but. And there's a star way up there. So yeah. If you've never seen Rockefeller Plaza, this is it. So, there you go. I'm finally getting vlog missy. So I'm just making a delivery at the New York Times right now. And in their giant lobby, because I'm in the New York Times building, they have an entire building. They have this digital art display on both sides of these walls. And it takes like segments that people are commenting on and reading and writing all from the times like each week and sort of like broadcasts them up on these little screens. I mean, altogether it doesn't really make sense, but 
you can just read, hold on, let me focus, you can just read these little sentences. Hold on, they keep changing. She's supposed to be a feminist. They keep changing. <laughs> Yeah, it's really cool. I mean, you could probably sit here forever and just read them all. If they don't stop like that. <laughs> so, if you ever come to New York, you're allowed in here. You can walk through the lobby and read all these little notes. Okay, one more feature of the New York Times building. They have a little courtyard in the middle. And it opens right up for this tree. Really beautiful. So yeah, that's the New York Times. Oh my god, guys, today was such a long day. <laughs> right? <laughs> um, I'm about to leave work. It's dark outside already. It's only 5 o'clock. But I just wanted to show you that we opened this advent calendar and like, first of all, the dates are in gold so you can't even see them. So when you're trying to find the proper date, they're like all random and you can't find it. But anyway, you open the little window and there's a chocolate inside. I mean, all the ones that are open don't have chocolates because we ate them. But um, yeah, so that's how an advent calendar works and this one's full of marzipan So it's not like the yummiest one, but they're kind of fun because you never know what you're gonna get on a specific day Which is basically also true in life because we had no idea what today was gonna be like and <laughs> It was interesting, but it was also it was really cool because we got to see all different kinds of offices. So Yeah Happy vlogmas day five <laughs>